I did nothing wrong, okay? I did nothing wrong. You're upset because I'm filming you right now. Turn around. I'm not. So you are looking right here at some lapel camera footage from a Bernalillo County deputy during a situation weeks ago. It is now, however, being called an example of excessive use of force. Spencer shot breaks down the video and we want to warn you what you're about to see might be disturbing. Stay in your car. What started as a traffic stop for speeding in the East Mountains quickly turned violent. Why are you going to tase me, bro? After the driver, 31-year-old Gregory Buchanan got out of his car holding what he said was his papers and didn't listen when the deputy, Patrick Rayel, told him to get back into his car. <laughs> deputy Rayel tased Buchanan, then told him he was under arrest as the two continued to scream at each other. Turn around. I'm around. Put your hands I'm around. Put your hands behind your back. Oh. They're right here. The whole time, Buchanan's wife, Jalissa Dominguez, was filming on her phone. Hey, hey, film it. While in handcuffs and pushed against a squad car, Buchanan was tased again before going in the back seat. Have a seat. Yeah, That's sir. when Deputy Rayel turned his attention on Dominguez. Turn around. No, you're uh, Turn around. Not today. I'm Turn sorry. Around. I'm not. Turn around. I did nothing wrong. The video shows she walks backwards down the dirt road until Deputy Rayel grabs her by the wrist and pushes her into a barbed wire fence and then onto the ground to put her in handcuffs. He then calls for backup. But when the other deputy arrives... Please, no! What are you doing to us? According to the criminal complaint, Deputy Rayel claims while in handcuffs, Dominguez grabbed his hand with force and was trying to get free. Stop! Resisting! Soon after Buchanan and Dominguez were in custody, though, all charges against them were dropped by the district attorney. And Deputy Rayel was put on administrative leave as the department investigates his excessive use of force. A BCSO spokesperson says in order to crack down on use of force cases like this one, they're conducting random body camera checks on all of their deputies. The spokesperson says they take use of force claims like this seriously. So D Deputy Rayel will be on administrative leave until this investigation is complete. Spencer Shaw, KOB4.